You did it. You made it to day two. Congratulations. We're very excited that you have put your mind to this and that you are doing it. You're following through with what you decided to do. So day two, the one thing we want to talk about is detox. It can be physical and it can be mental. So remember that when you are feeling these changes, like you may be having headaches, you may not be able to go to the bathroom, you may be um, having flu-like symptoms, and you also may be emotional. You may be crying for no reason. You may um, be kind of moody. You may do, you know, be angry, things like that. All of this is detoxing all these things out of your body and your body is gonna start throwing fits. It's gonna say, just give us what we're used to. It likes to be in a routine. It likes to have what it likes to have and it's used to you fueling it in a certain way. So if you have started fueling your body in a separate way, in a different way, then it's probably going to throw a fit until you give in. Don't give in. Detox usually lasts one to three days. You can do it. Push through. You're going to be so glad that you did. And you are going to feel so much better. You can do this. Um, if you're having detox symptoms, I recommend that you drink a gallon of water. I know that on your paper it might say that you don't have to drink a complete gallon. I would recommend that you drink a gallon. It's going to help flush those toxins out. Toxins out. It's going to make you feel better. It's going to help you go to the restroom. If you are not going to the restroom, you need to message your coach. If you're feeling any detox symptoms, or if you are just feeling different, message your coach. They have so many tricks and tips that they can help adjust this system to fit you and your body because we are not cookie cutter people. We're all different. They have coached thousands of people and they can help you change things to fit you and make you comfortable and make it where you can push through and get to where you need to be so that you can reach your goals. So connect with your coach if you're feeling any detox symptoms and keep pushing through. I also want to tell you that to stay prepared. I think when we get off, it's when we're not prepared. We get off because we need something, we're starving, we want something, um, it's time to eat, we don't have anything ready, and so we just grab something. Oh, it'll, it's okay, it'll work. No, don't do that. Be prepared. And you can also pick up a few things. You can pick up one of these. They have them on Amazon. Maybe not the one that says Zingular on it, but they do have these on um, on Amazon. On the bottom, it's just a shaker cup. So you can mix up your shake, and then... You can put your shake in here so you can carry it with you. So this is the easy way to jump in the car, know that you have two snacks right here available or a lunch and a snack, however you're doing it for the day, and be on the road. Also, these little pill dividers, just like a seven-day pill divider, and mine was labeled a long time ago at one point um, because I couldn't remember what all, the, all of the supplements were. So you can use this. You can chunk this in your purse. That way, if you're ever not home on time or running late or need to stay overnight or whatever, you have all your supplements with you. I've actually gone to this and I love this because it holds like the whole bottle. So I don't have all these bottles in my cabinet. I just have this one large thing with my supplements in it. Um, so those are some things. Also, little baby formula. If you go to the baby section, they have like, it's a little round canister and it has three different compartments in it. And it's so you can put baby formula in it. Well, you can put one scoop of shakes. So I'll give you three shakes on the go. Because if all else fails, take a shake. Put something in your body to make sure that it's fueled so that you're in fat burning mode, not fat storing mode. Your body is not wigging out going, I don't know when she's going to feed us next. We should just have something. No. Get a shake. It'll satisfy you. It'll last until you get to where you need to be. And then it'll keep you on track. So it's day two. Day two is all about detox. You can do it. And reach out to your coach. Let them know how you're feeling. Let them know how you're doing. Even if you're feeling great, connect with your coach.